June 30th is the deadline. Circle your camera, your, your calendars uh, for the federal student loan forgiveness program's deadline, okay? Many people who qualify still need to apply, and most borrowers with long-time federal student loans will either qualify for total loan forgiveness, which is great, or greatly reduce payments, which works as well. So Ray Kaplan is an attorney and student loan expert. She joins me this morning with a few tips on the application process. That's Kaplan with a K. You know, we have a Kaplan with a C around here, too. Oh, right. <laughs> With a K. <laughs> yeah, no relation here. So uh, first, let's just talk about how people apply and if there's anything we need to keep in mind for parents and students uh, when they are. Well, this is really the largest student loan debt relief program in the history of the United States. Mm -hmm. And what's really important to know is that it is over June 30th. So June 30th is the deadline. And people who have federal student loans need to go to studentaid.gov. Okay. So that's the website that's run by the Department of Education. If you have federal loans, they'll populate in there and most people will receive some type of relief under this executive order. So it's really important. I don't want people to miss out on it because it really is transformational change. We had one of our clients had $300,000 in her federal loans forgiven. Another wow. client, a 70-year-old grandmother, had $150,000 in her loans forgiven, which is really fantastic. Yeah, that is amazing. And it's probably not going to come back around for a while. So um, is the application process itself complicated? Would you say we need somebody to kind of walk us through it step by step? You know, it can be complicated. For some people, it's actually going to happen automatically. And for others, the their situation is a little bit more complex. We help people navigate that process all the time because the federal student loan system is a complicated area and people need help with navigating the system. Mm -hmm. And so many people, um, the first thing you should do is go to studentaid.gov just to see if indeed your loans are federal. And for the most part, if you've been carrying your loans for a long time, decades maybe, it, for mostly for people in their 40s and 50s, this is going to be a huge amount of relief. And for many people, it will happen right away or you'll just get decades shaved off your loan payment term, which is great too. Yeah, it sure is. Yeah, so, all right, let's talk about what parents and students need to be doing uh, when they break out and, and start thinking about student loans in the first place. Like, is every student loan kind of formulated the same? Do they work the same? What do we need to know in terms of the differences? That's a great question. So the thing is that some student loans are better than others, right? And a big part of what I do is to strategize with families so that they take out the right type of student loan mm -hmm. because that can make the difference between having to pay back say 30,000 versus 80,000 and it can make the difference between a $100 monthly payment or an $800 monthly payment mm -hmm. so you want to be strategic about the type of loan that you're going to take out mm -hmm. and that makes all the difference but Congress has addressed this problem and there is so much relief available. Most people don't know about it. And the key is to know it so that you can get access to that relief. Yeah, let me ask you, is, is there a such thing, if you're paying regularly, is there a such thing as like taking too much time to pay off a student loan? Well, what most people don't know is that the government has provided ways to enter into an income-driven plan. So the longest they can stretch it out is 20 years. And in many cases, you can get your loans forgiven in 10 years. You just have to know which payment plan is the right one for you. And that's really where most people get tripped up. Okay, again, June 30th is the date, right, that we June need to remember? June 30th, that is the big deadline. Apply now, studentaid.gov. Okay, everybody, you heard it right there from Ray Kaplan. Make sure you get in where you fit in so you can cut that debt. Thank you so much for being here. Thank Let's you.